Cockpit uh, temperature readout still says it's 100 degrees, so it is toasty here in Kansas City. We're at Kansas City Downtown Airport. All right, let's get the weather. No contact, give information golf. Information golf. Kansas City Downtown Airport, information golf. 2154, wind 20012, visibility 10, sky clear. Temperature 35, 2.22, altimeter 2986. Visual approach, runway 19 in use, climb in, parking runway 19 and runway 21. Host chairman, runway 2 and Vatsy out of service. Five on initial contact, give information, Golf. Clarence, plus 9021, November Golf on the ground at, uh, well, here at uh, downtown, across the IFR to uh, Goshen Golf, Zero Hotel. Plus 921 November Golf Downtown Ground Crew to Goshen Airport via the Lake Street Departure Spinner Transition Direct Climb Maintain 3000. Expect flight level 23010 minutes after departure. Departure frequency 118.4, Squawk 2104. 921 November Golf cleared as file, Lake Street Spinner Transition uh, 3000, 230 in 10 minutes, departure 18.4, Squawk 2104. Plus 1 November Golf, free back. All right, so we're clear to file. We're going to fly the Lakes 3 departure, center transition, then direct to Goshen. And ground 921 November Golf with Golf at Signature, ready to taxi. Pilatus 921 November Golf, downtown ground, runway 19 or taxi via Golf, hold short, runway 21. Runway 19 or via Golf, hold short of 21, enter 21 November Golf. Pilatus 1 November Golf. If you prefer a runway 21 uh, intersection golf departure, we can get that for you as well. Yeah, we can take that 1 November Golf. Sorry, I stepped on you. What'd you say? Yes, sir, I'd take that 1 November Golf. Pilatus 1 November Golf. Roger, runway 21 intersection golf. Taxi we go. 21 at golf, 1 November Golf. November Golf, uh, 4,300 feet remaining from uh, golf at the runway 21. 1 November Golf, Roger, thanks. And we'll go ahead and taxi. All right, taxiing to runway 21 at intersection golf. More than 4,000 feet remaining. That'll be plenty. And here's golf, take a right. This will save us a little bit of time on taxi. Go ahead and switch over to tower. Tap, tap, tower, helicopter 4 Sierra Bravo is world's fun, headed to the TV towers, please. 
And then we'll hold short here at golf. I need to review the uh, departure, make sure I've got everything for 2-1 since I was set up for 1-9. tower, seat is requested, and remain, uh, remain east of the, uh, the antennas for now. As requested, but east of the antennas for Sierra Bravo. As requested, east of the runway. All right, runways, so 2-1, 2-1-7 to 2300. The two one seven heading bug. Then climb on a sign heading for radar vectors. Sounds pretty pretty easy. Tower nine two one November Golf, we're ready to go. Runway two one at golf. Colada is nine two one November to golf, downtown ground. Heading two one five, runway two one at golf, clear for takeoff. Two one five 2-1 at golf, clear for takeoff, 9-2-1 to rubber golf. All right, flaps and trims are set. Probes are on, windshields are on light, inertial separators open. Flight idle is uh, to go yet. And we've got flight director and go around and heading mode. Yacht amp verified off, lights are on. You guys ready? All right, let's do it. Light idle. Light crosswind. Here we go. Power set. Airspeed's coming alive. Hold the center line. Got our left aileron correction for the crosswind. On the brakes, stop the wheels, gears coming up. Better not, flaps can come up. Hey, you guys are going to get a great view of downtown there off the left wing. Downtown Kansas City. Taxi landing light can come off and you November hand. Golf, contact Kansas City departure. Two departure, we'll see you at 921 November Golf. Okay, 5,000. Afternoon departure, Plata Slander, 2 1 November Golf, off downtown 2000, climbing 3000, oh. heading 215. Plus 921 November Gulf Kansas City departure radar contact comma maintain 4000 turn left at 140. 4000 left 140 Niner one November Gulf. All right, clear on the left. We're going to be outside of those towers and above them, and we're turning to 140. One to go. And uh, 582, you're northbound now. Uh, is there a problem? Uh, I don't know if they passed on you. We're doing a uh, survey work over here for about 15, 20 more minutes and headed to St. Joseph. Roger that. They did not. Thank you. Flotus 1, November Golf. Turn left at the 060. Left heading 060, Niner 2, November Golf. Flotus 1, November Golf. I'm going to maintain 1, 5,000. I maintain one five thousand nine or two November Golf. All right, taking on up to fifteen. Go ahead and turn the inertial separator, pulse lights, and seat belt sign off. Plotus one November Golf, contact Kansas City Center one two five point two five. 25, 25, 1 November Golf, so long. Afternoon, Kansas City Center, Plotus Center, 2 November Golf, 11,600, climbing 1, 5,000. November Golf, Kansas City Center, climbing at Tampa, 2 Tree Zero. 2 Tree Zero, 1 November Golf. One November Golf, you clear direct your destination. Direct destination, 1 November Golf. You know, things are just a lot easier out here in the Midwest than uh, on the East Coast. 
Yeah, sure. Not even joined the arrival or departure yet. Just go direct destination, no problem. I like that. All right, so we just climbed through 18,000 feet, and here in the U.S., that's the transition level where we transition from using altitudes to flight levels. So we'll push this little button. If you push it in, it'll go to standard. It'll set 29.92 here in the Colsma window. And we'll also do it on the standby ESIS here. You either punch it up like that, or you can hit standard the S. does the same thing. And so now we're not really uh, at an altitude above anything, we're just at a pressure altitude. So we might be varying altitudes above the ground, we might climb and descend a little bit as we fly across. But we won't have to um, adjust anything on the pressure as we go across the U.S. here. And there's nothing to hit, so it's okay. go. We're in cruise now at flight level 230. We're uh, showing 180 knots indicated and 265 true on 422 pounds an hour. We've got the torque set at 28.4 PSI and it looks like it's going to be a good flight. We do have a little bit of weather to the south, but it's Actually, not really anywhere close to our route. And out the front here you can see uh, a little bit there off the right wing, you can see it down there. But should be a nice, good flight into Goshen. Glad to have you guys on board again. Thanks for coming. If you're enjoying the Pilatus hey, flights so and you want to see some more of them, go ahead and subscribe and hit the like button. And uh, we'll go ahead and uh, make the jump to light speed, and I'll catch you on the other side. Silver Niner still on November Golf, contact Chicago Center 119.32. Two one November Golf, Chicago Center, Roger, good evening. Box code of 7202. Silver one November Golf, contact Chicago Center 120.12 and have a beautiful week. Pilatus Center 2 one November Golf, Chicago Center, Roger. Pilatus Center 2 one November Golf, Chicago Center, November 1, November Golf, descend and maintain 17,000 in Chicago altimeter 2,903. November 1, November Welcome back. Glad you guys survived the jump to light speed there. Currently, we're descending, uh, we've descended to 17,000. And we are 81 miles out of Goshen. Should be able to get the weather. Let's uh, pick it up here. The altitude 2,407. Goshen Municipal Airport, Goshen, Indiana. Automated weather observation. 2, 3, 4, 8, Zulu. Wind calm. Visibility 1, 0. Sky condition clear. Temperature 2, 7 Celsius. 2.21 Celsius. Altimeter 2, 9, 9, 6. Remark. Enter the altitude 2. All right, weather looks really good. Calm winds. Chicago, pretty warm. 66 out of 26 for 240. We left Kansas City a little bit earlier than we were planning on. If we had left at our planned time, we would have landed at Goshen right at dusk, which would have been pretty neat, right as the sun was setting. But as it is, we'll be landing right there in Golden Hour, which I think that'll look pretty cool too. For one November Golf, descend and maintain one three thousand. Descend and maintain one three thousand nine two one November Golf. November one November Golf, descend and maintain one one thousand. One one thousand nine two one November Golf. November 1, November Golf, traffic 1 o'clock, 8 miles northwest, sun, it's a 737, level 1, 0, I'll look for him, 1, November Golf. 1 o'clock, 8 miles, probably uh, southwest, 737, I would guess. November 1, November Golf, contact South Bend Approach, 125.75. South Bend, 2575, 1, November Golf, good night. Yeah. 
South Bend, Pilatus, Standard 2 on November Golf, 13, descending 11. Beach at 1116 Romeo, South Bend Approach, I'll tell here is 2996. I got two going to Goshen, so for 16 Romeo, um, weather notams available, expect a visual approach. Beach at 16 Romeo, cleared, visual approach at the Goshen Airport. Ah, uh, they're going to beat me. Summer 921, November Golf, South Bend Approach, heard you coming into Goshen, South Bend Tender, 2996. Weather is available on Notams as well. And uh, just going to maintain 4,000, expect the visual approach. Just in 4,000, I do have the weather Notams there at Goshen and uh, planning on the visual one, November Golf. It is just a great evening for flying tonight, guys. It's so smooth. That's the late afternoon sun, makes everything look nice. Looking for Goshen, about 17 miles up there. You guys have it in sight yet? Track 1 3 Tango Papa, South Bend. I've got it inside up there. It's probably kind of hard for you guys to see. 1,000 to go, that's what that tone means. 1,000 to our selected altitude. Legion 2252, descend and maintain 6,000. 6,000, Legion 2252. Flight is one over golf, to maintain 2,500, Goshen Airport, 12 o'clock, one, two miles, port and safe. Yeah, I've got inside, I can cancel that far with you now, one over golf. Flight is one over golf, Roger, F can't station, receive squawk vehicle, only traffic I see that may be a factor for you, currently three miles south of the field, northwest bound, 2,300 indicated, good day. One over golf, Roger, good day. All right, so somebody uh, southwest Goshen, of the field. Somebody entering left base, we'll go ahead and turn the autopilot off and hand fly it in. Goshen traffic, plot us 9 or 2 on November Golf, 9.5 miles to the southwest, inbound land 27, Goshen. <clears throat> Goshen traffic, Cardinal 3181 Tango's 1 mile to the south, the inner left downwind for runway 27, Goshen. Alright, so this guy on left base and the Cardinal on downwind, so we better slow it up. Ghost traffic experimental, zero kilo fox stress, taxi and runway 27, Ghost. Oh, traffic 6 one uniform crosswind. Nice traffic. thing about being in a Pilatus is we can slow down to 182 speeds and we don't have to make them feel like we're being a jerk and uh, kick them out of the way or have to go way out of the way to get around them and join the pattern. We can just mix right in. Pretty nice. Go ahead and turn the flight director off. Not going to be using that here. And pattern altitude here at Goshen is 2,300, 1,500 foot AGL for a turbine airplane. So we will stop there. Still looking for that 182. I don't have him in sight yet. Bear below 165. We'll go ahead and put approach flaps in. And we'll go ahead and put the gear down to help Just us slow down. Cardinal 3181 Tango is turning left base, 27 Goshen. Okay, the Cardinal's turning left base now. Still don't have him in sight. Add some power back to about 15 PSI here. Goshen traffic plot us 9 or 2 1 November Golf, uh, 2 miles. To the west on the left downwind for 27 Goshen. Goshen traffic, Cardinal 3181 Tango, turning final, 27 Goshen. Okay, I've got him in sight there. Okay, we've got somebody on upwind. I didn't hear them make a departure call, but it's not required. You can uh, fly out of small airports. Traffic system 19056, you're on the upwind 27, we'll follow behind the plot. Goshen. You can, you can fly out of small airports like Goshen without making any radio calls. It's not required. So it's our responsibility as pilots to make sure we watch out for other airplanes. So we're looking for ones that are making radio calls, but are also looking out for people that might not even have a radio. Or they might uh, be on the wrong frequency and not realize it, or their radio might not be working. Goshen traffic, 
beam the numbers there. We already got the gear down, so we'll bring the power back to about 8 PSI. And we'll start our descent. But turn the taxi and landing lights off, or on, I mean. Ghost traffic, Cardinal 3181 Tango is clear, runway 2 sub Ghost traffic, Quad Ascender 2 on November Golf, turning the left base 27 Goshen. And just do a quick final check here, landing gear, we've got three green flaps. Our set is required for now. Difference pressure is below 0.7 and decreasing. Okay, the speed is good. And we'll get the odd amp on final. Final is clear. Goshen traffic, Quadis 9 or 2 on November Golf, turning final 2-7 Goshen. Sun's going to be kind of bright. Go ahead and set 30 degrees of flaps below 130. 500. And yawn amps away. Runway is clear. Very good to land. Blowing down to the DSB, the dynamic speed bug, which is about 78 knots here today. Pretty slow approach speed. And got a power Coast parachute Coast there, Coast taking Coast off the crossing runway. And we'll clean up the airplane, flaps come up. Ice protection Coast goes Coast off. Pulse landing and strobe lights all come off. Goshen traffic, Quadis 9 or 2 on November Golf, clear runway 27 Goshen. And RFI IFR was already cancelled, so we don't need to do that. And we'll drop passengers off here at the FBO. Well, thanks for riding along, everybody. I really appreciate it. Always fun having you. And we'll see you on the next one. Final runway 27.